Good evening, folks. Miami Beach Audits here. Uh, they're finally going to allow the bars on Ocean Drive to close at 5 a.m. A week and a half ago, a judge found that they breached their contract in the liquor license, which allows the 5 a.m. closing, and ordered the city to resume 5 a.m. closing times instead of 2. But the 2 a.m. closing time was legislated by city ordinance, and they continued to enforce it despite being threatened with a contempt of court charge until the city commission met on Wednesday and repealed the ordinance because the mayor and commissioners apparently feel that their ordinances take precedence over court rulings or contracts. Now they've instituted an ordinance which requires off-duty police to, to work security at those clubs. 25 years ago, when the current mayor's father was mayor, they had such an ordinance in place. The FBI brought three police officers up on federal charges for extorting money from the nightclub owners. Subsequently, they passed an ordinance that prohibited police from working security at alcoholic beverage establishments. One of the commissioners cited Ragamonkey's video of his being shoved by the Mangoes bouncer as a reason why they need police there instead of club employees and mentioned if the cops had been there they could have just arrested the guy for trespassing on the public sidewalk because these lawmakers have apparently the, as little understanding of the trespass law as the police and they believe that they can dictate proper and improper uses of public space when the US Supreme Court has already established otherwise Here's another one that involves Officer Lamoka, who you may recall from one of my previous videos, or several of them. This guy was on the public sidewalk outside the restaurant. He never entered it. He couldn't have entered their property because it's closed for renovations. Police said the officers were checking on the property due to people continuously trespassing on it, which means they didn't have a complaint specific to that incident which is what the trespass law requires, even if it is private property. But this man was arrested on a public sidewalk. Now this happened on Monday morning. I saw this guy on Tuesday night. He was looking for his dog after he got out of jail. He tells me the judge dismissed the case at the bond hearing after reading the narrative on the arrest form and determining that he was in fact on a public sidewalk and there was no complaint. And he says that after dismissing his case, the judge asked anybody else here from Miami Beach for trespassing and four other people came up and he immediately dismissed all four of their cases without even reading the arrest forms. So apparently the courts see this as a chronic problem. Uh, it says they claim Johnson reached into a bag and was ordered not to reach for anything or grab anything. Johnson told me that he informed the cops he was reaching into the bag for the leash after they told him to put the dog on the leash. And they said okay, and then handcuffed him before he could get the leash out of the bag. And when they handcuffed him, the dog started growling and barking and they tasered him. After being tasered, the dog ran off. And Johnson took off after the dog with the handcuffs on. They caught Johnson before he caught the dog. I tend to believe Dante rather than the police on this one. Also, it says the dog was a white pit bull. They probably said that because pit bulls have a reputation as an aggressive breed. I saw Dante Wednesday night and he had found the dog and he had it with him. It had apparently run to a friend's apartment where Dante sometimes stays and the friend took it in and waited for Dante to come by. Now this dog has no pit in it. It has no bulldog in it. It's a Collie Golden Retriever mix. It has the head and body of a Collie, only it's white. And it's the most docile, friendly dog you'll ever meet. Now this is Miami Beach Audits. I'm out of here. I'll see you on the next one. Remember to like, share, subscribe, hit that bell notification, and leave a comment in the comment section because it helps the algorithm.